Hello, good evening. Can you hear me? Yes, good night. Okay, good evening. How are you? I'm good. Okay. Good evening. Glad to see you again. Good evening. Good evening, how are you? I am fine, thanks. How do you feel today? Fine? Okay. Fine. I like to hear that. that fine. You, that you feel fine. Really, really important that you feel fine, okay? How was your day? Who wants to tell me how was your day? I was really, really, really hard today. <sighs> really, really hard. I've been pretty busy. I'm feeling so sick. Kind of sick? You, you are feeling kind of sick? Sick. Oh, really? Sick. Yes. Ah. Okay. What kind of symptom do you feel? Do you feel a uh, temperature, headache, backache? All my body hurt. Ah, okay. <laughs> Maybe it's a stress. Could be a stress. We never know. I'm just checking the attendance in order to be sure that all of you are going to be here in the class. I got only 13 students. Let me drink some water before I start. <clears throat> I've been talking the whole day, you know, with different groups and different ages. And sometimes it's really difficult for me. And for that reason, I recommend you to drink a lot of liquid because I do it during the whole day. Okay, my camera is this on. Okay, I got 14. I'm still waiting for the rest. Hello, Claudia. Everything fine, Claudia? Yes, everything okay. Okay, nice. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> My mom is typing me in WhatsApp, so. <laughs> ah, okay. If I, if I don't ask where she 
Sí, ¿qué más? Ah, ok. Uh -huh. Ok, Yesenia, hello. You are so serious, Yesenia. Sí. Yes. Ok. Aunque no le gusta Yesenia, creo que le gusta más Lisette. No, no me gusta. Ah, vos sos de Ok. Sí. Ok. Carlos Rivas, hello. Glad to see you again. Welcome, okay. sir. Very good, I'm very fine. Ok. María Concepción. Are you there, Maria? Hello, teacher. Hello, how are you? So, so. Okay, welcome back. Diego Ernesto is ready to. Hello, yes. teacher. Hello, sir. I'm how here. are you? I'm fine, teacher. Okay, that is nice. Very nice. Okay, Carlos Antonio Escobar. Is ready too with the headphones. Hello, good evening. Hello, sir. Good evening. You good lost evening. your connection with your camera. I don't know why. Pretty busy today, sir. Hey, teacher. Just a little bit? Yes. Okay. That is the pride to be the most important person in your company, you know? That you need to resolve all the problems. <laughs> yeah? You, you need to pay the price for that. Maybe suddenly you are starting sleeping and the telephone ring and somebody is asking you some advices and you have to answer. Maria Elena. Hello, Maria Elena. I don't Hello. see your face there. Ah, now I, I can see it. A little bit. Okay. The dog is barking, the dog is barking. Brian, 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 hello, Brian. Hello, teacher. How are you, sir? All nice. Ready, ready? Yeah, teacher, I'm ready. Okay, excellent. Let me see, uh, Laura Carolina. Are you ready too? Yes. Ready, teacher. Yes. Okay. Thank you. Bautista, I don't see you fake, Bautista. Hello, teacher. Hello, sir. How are you? Uh, fine. Uh, a few minutes I uh, stay at home. Ah, okay, okay. Don't worry. Take it easy, relax. Okay, Anna Lilian, hello, Anna Lilian. Hello, teacher. How are you? How are you? How is it going? Mm. Good. Okay. <laughs> okay, with the expression, I, I know how do you feel. Yeah. Yes. Okay, I already talked with Lisette, Jonathan. Hello, Jonathan. Hello, mister. How are you, sir? I'm tired. A little tired? A little tired. Tired, tired, tired. Tired. Okay. Okay, try to keep active participating in order to avoid that you can fall asleep, okay? And suddenly, okay, 
if you feel that you are kind of sleepy, just stand up, drink water, uh, breathe deep and keep the air inside your lung. And then in a slowly way, uh, through it out, coming from one to five, maybe. That is gonna help you a lot. Okay, Jenny, Jenny, hello, Jenny. Are you there, Jenny? Hi, teacher. Hello, yes. hello, hello. I'm I can here. see you. I can see you. I can see you. Ah, you are there. <laughs> uh, are you are you still in your work or not? Uh, no. Okay, in your house. In my house. Oh, yes. Okay. Okay, excellent. Thank you. Santos Misael. Hello, good evening, teacher. Hello, sir. How are you? I'm very tired too, but ready to continue. Okay, okay. The same to you, try to participate. Uh, suddenly, if you feel that you are falling asleep, uh, try to drink some water and try to stretch yourself and breathe the pool and that way you are going to keep uh, relaxed, okay? I already talked with Maria Elena, Elizabeth, Elizabeth Martinez is there, we are not sure. Hello, Elizabeth. Elizabeth is not there, uh-huh. Elizabeth. Jose Galileo. Galileo. Hey, sir, good evening. Hello, hello, sir, how are you? Fine. Okay. Great, I can't complain. Okay, okay. Excellent. And Saira Marlene Larin is there too. Okay. Okay, let me check out the, the attendance now. Let me see. Here we go. I have not missed any name today, okay? Beatriz, Ana Beatriz. Present teacher. Okay. Ana Lilian Reyes. Present teacher. Ahí está, ahí está. Va, y ustedes dicen no, no está, ahí está. Ahí está. Bautista. Present teacher. Eso, Bautista. Escobar. Present. Eh, Claudia Raquel. Present. Eh, Francis Elizabeth. Francis. Present teacher. Ah, ya yeah, apareció, ya yeah, apareció. Ahí está. Ok. Galileo. Present, sir. Ok, welcome, sir. It is a pleasure to see you. Me too. Jose Jonathan Vigil. Present, Mr. Welcome. Thank you. Jose Rodrigo. I haven't seen Rodrigo today, I don't know. Um, Juan Carlos Rivas. Present teacher. Okay. Laura Carolina. Present teacher. Laura, ahí está. Lorena Beatriz. Lorena Beatriz. No, no here. Um, María Concepción. Present. Welcome. María Elena. I'm here. Mayra, 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 ¿qué le estará pasando a Mayra? Miguel Ángel, Miguel Ángel is not here too. Zaira Marlene. 
present teacher. Okay. Santos Misael. Present teacher. Eh, Wendy Maribel. Present teacher. Okay, okay. Jenny Suleima. Present teacher. Yesenia Lisset. Present teacher. Diego Ernesto. Present teacher. Brian Javier. Present. Okay, thank you. Absent, we have one, two, three, four. Let me see. Only four. Let me count again. One, two. Okay, Rodrigo is not here. Um, Lorena is not here. Mayra is not here. And Miguel. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. No problem. Okay, hold on a second. I need to close some windows because I have a lot of windows open. One more, I'm gonna close it too. I got it. Okay, and this one too, I'm gonna close it. My goodness, I have a lot of, a lot of scenes open. Okay, here we go. Hold on a little bit. I need to show you my presentation. I'm gonna close this one because I don't need it. And we are going to show you this one, okay? Here we go. Can you see it? Yes. Just tell me if you can see it. Yes, teacher. Yes, I can. Okay. Okay. Today we are going to talk about strategies for testing new product conversation. This is class number six. And before to start talking about the class of today, uh, I would like to hear it. Son, what do you remember? What do you remember about yesterday? What we talked. Just tell me, what do you remember about yesterday? In your own word, in a brief way, tell me. What do you remember that we studied yesterday? Okay, tell me. I remember uh, we review about uh, and cloud. Ah, oh, okay. Excellent. What else do you remember? And any verbs? The regular verbs. Okay, irregular verbs. I remember that I show you a chart where you can find the pronunciation. At uh, this moment, I consider that you already know at least the half of the list. Is that true? Or more than the half of the, of the list, maybe you have it in your mind. Okay. 
Okay, let us start talking about the new topic today. Uh, in order to start, we need to answer some question. In this case, the first one is, have you ever heard the term product testing? What do you know about that? That is the first question. Have you ever heard the term product testing? Just tell me. Tell me. No, yes. teacher, I never, never heard. Okay, okay. Somebody else? In my case, I, well, yes, I have here okay. the term product testing. Okay, that means that you are familiar with the term. Yes. <laughs> Excellent. Somebody else, please? Listen in someone's product uh, news. Okay, when the product is news and, uh, and the, the in product, the company is going to launch it to the to the market, okay? Okay, what about uh, the second one? There are two primary type of tests to evaluate the product. The site and the handling, handling tests and the use tests. What do you know about them? Do you have any idea about these different tests? Just tell me, be honest and tell me, yes, teacher, I know because I remember when I was studying or when I was studying uh, in a training in my company, they told us about this and blah, 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 you know. Two primary type of tests to evaluate a product. The site and the handling tests and the use test. Do you know something about it? Any idea? No? Let me see your faces because no, I don't see teacher. I don't see no, it. Teacher. No, teacher, I don't know. Ah, okay, be honest. Be honest and tell me. Be me too, honest. I don't know. You don't know? No. Uh-huh, okay. Today we are going to learn a little bit about that and uh, you are going to keep it in your mind in order that you can use it later on. Okay. Remember that in every process we have different steps. In this case, when we are talking about a new product, um, maybe there are a lot of different way how to evaluate it but this is the most common uh, in order to do it. And another question that I would like to ask you is, do you consider that it's really important or important to evaluate a product before we launch it to the market? Why or why not? Tell me, what is your point of view? I would like to hear you. Teacher, repeat the question, please. Ah, okay, I'm going to repeat the question. Do you think, do you consider that it's really important to evaluate a product before launch it to the market? Yes, it is important. Okay, tell me why, the reason? Um, because uh, we test the um, quality of product before the people can say the product is wrong or the product tastes uh, bad. Okay. Okay, I'm following with you. Sure. I, I think I think yes is very important uh, for the other characteristic. Okay, feature characteristic. 
no, no, no only the, the quality, uh, maybe the other characteristics with the color, uh, the price, price. Or, um, in others, the <coughs> uh, details. Okay, uh, I say feature, feature, repeat, features. 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 Yeah. Mm -hmm. Detail. Also, yes. we, we can say detail, we can say feature, we can say characteristic, we can say aspect. Yeah, different words, you know? Yes. Okay. Okay, thank you. Okay, thank you. That is really important, okay? Teacher. Tell me, sir. I think that is really important because there are a lot of concept concept okay behind that sprout uh, i think one company cannot uh, through or show up on one product if this company don't know don't know this product Okay. It's really important uh, to know this product, to think if the customer accept, will be accepting this product. Okay. Okay. And, and that way, that means that the company has to look for a better uh, marketing uh, campaign in order to show the product and all the advantages and even talking about price, quality, uh, shape, uh, size, in different way, you know? That is yeah, the company, the company needs to know what the customer needs. Yes, that's true. Before, before create the product, uh, the company needs to know yes, sir. Uh, what the customer needs. So when the company know that concept, they create a product and they need to test this product. Okay, thank you. It's a really good comment, Galileo. Thank you. I do really appreciate it. Thank you. Okay, okay. somebody else want to say something about it? I know that you know, you have some ideas about this. Because when you are, at the moment that you are watching TV, uh, suddenly you can see some ad in, in, in the TV that they are telling you that you need to buy something. They try to create the need in order that you buy it, you know? In order that you buy it. And as soon as you go to the market, you say, ah, I saw it on TV, I'm going to buy it. Maybe you don't need it. For that reason, we need to be careful. There is a word, there is a term, I don't know if you know, know it. What is shopaholics? What is the meaning of the word? Have you, ha have you ever heard the word? Yes. Ah, okay. <laughs> okay. For well, that reason, we need to be careful about it, okay? Somebody else want to say something about this? No? Okay, the importance of product testing. Okay, testing is an essential part of developing a quality product. It helps manufacturer create products that are reliable within certain technical standards. In other words, testing is a necessary step for product development term to go through to provide high quality product that last. Perhaps most important product testing can ensure that an item is safe for general use. That is the main purpose that company had to study in order to, before to launch a product. And remember that uh, we already have started the swap analysis that they had to do. 
evolve a, pre, a specific product, okay? Do you still keep in mind the swap analysis? Yes. I didn't hear you. <laughs> yes. Ah, okay, okay, thank you. Thank you, thank you. Okay, let me see. We have a conversation here. I invite you to take a look of it. Hold on a second, I'm moving something here in order to see it very well. Okay, hold on, I'm gonna put it here. Okay, product testing are necessary, uh, press sure to be followed before deciding to create a new product. The following conversation feature a group of manager in a meeting to discuss strategies for testing their new product. Read the conversation. Okay. A group of manager in a meeting. Let us see what is happening there, Mr. Velez and Ms. Ajala. Good morning, I'm thrilled to announce we have green light to work on our latest product testing test. One of the good things I like about working with you all is the effort you make to do the job well. I agree with you, Mr. Ayala. The efforts this task requires are important to take into account. Definitely, I have already written some idea for a monadic test, so we can discuss them, take a look. Good luck. But have you figured out the cost? Some difficult decision to make recall to fancy material and cost versus quality. Yes, boss. One of the most important factor in this job is managing costs and I'm good on at that. Okay, I invite you to read again and get familiar with the conversation in order that we can feel it. Okay? Try to read it in Teacher. your own pause. Hello, sir. Can you repeat? Mr. in the first uh, linear. The first line, good morning. The day? Si, day. Okay, good morning. I'm thrilled to announce we have green light to work on our lace product testing task. Thank you. Okay. Remember that I'm going to read it uh, three times. The next one is going to be in a slowly way, and the last one is going to be like in a hurry, okay, in order that you get familiar. But I invite you to read it first, and then I'm going to read it again. Try to read it. Okay, I'm going to read again. I don't know if you already finished. Good morning. I'm thrilled to announce we have green light to work on our latest product testing task. One of the good things I like about working with you all is the effort you made to do the job well. I agree with you, Mr. Ayala. The efforts this task requires are important to take into account. Definitely, I have already written some idea for a monadic test. So we can discuss then, take a look. Good job. But have you figured out the cost? 
some difficult decision to make repair the fancy material and cost versus quality. Yes, boss. One of the most important factors in this job is managing costs and I'm good at that. Okay. Are you there? Yes. Yes, sir. Okay, yes. okay, okay. Somebody wants to try? Only yes, a couple. And I'm going to help you, okay? Do you, do you want me to read again or you, do you want to do it? Just tell me. Teacher. Hello, lady. Uh, lo puede leer una vez más. Okay. Lento, normal, rápido. Lento. Ah, okay. Por favor, no, please, no. Slow. In a... Teacher is on mute. Yes, on mute. I need that you read it completely before I start reading again, please. Try to read it and later on I'm going, I'm going to read it again. Okay, I'm going to read again in a slowly way. Good morning. I'm thrilled to announce we have green light to work on our latest product testing dash. One of the good things I like about working with you all is the effort you make to do the job well. I agree with you, Mr. Ajala. The efforts this task requires are important to take into account. Definitely, I have already written some ideas for a magnetic test, so we can discuss them. Take a look. Good job. But have you figured it out the cost? Some difficult decisions to make refer to fancy material and cost versus quality. Yes, boss. One of the most important factors in this job is managing costs. And I'm good at that. Okay. I did. Any question so far from here? Hello? No, sir, any question? No question, okay. I want to be sure that you don't have question. Teacher. Hello, sir? Um, could you tell me a synonym or the meaning of the, the first, I mean, when uh, say good morning, I'm thrilled. Ah, this one. It, it is like uh, I'm fascinated to announce. I'm happy to announce. Ah, okay. Okay. Thank you. Okay, okay. What else? I have another one. <laughs> okay, Mr. Uh, it goes for Mr. Velasquez. Is when he says. Some difficult decision to make refer to fancy materials. Fancy material, what does it mean? Fancy materials. Okay, 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 okay. Let me see where you are talking about. 
Uh, hello. Let's see. Bellish, 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 bellish. So, okay, the highlighted phrase, some difficult to see. Yeah. To make reference to. Okay. I got it. To make a uh, reference to fancy material. Fancy material. And cost versus quality, right? Yes, I um, I was wondering about the term fancy. Fancy is like a luxury, you know? Luxury. Uh -huh. Yeah. Kind of. <laughs> it is the same. Um, you feel the same? Uh, what about if I say in Espanol, material de fantasía, de lujo? Ah. Something that... It's como the... high cost materials. Yeah, could be. Okay, thank you. Okay, okay. Algo de, de, de qué? De, de, de calidad, pues. Okay, if you don't have more questions, let us start reading in order that we can get familiar with it and then we are going to practice. Who wants to participate? Me, yes, sir. Okay, go ahead. And somebody else who wants to help him? Me. Me. And Claudia. Okay, Claudia. Yesenia va después. Okay, do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Okay. Good morning. I'm thrilled to announce we have green light to work on our latest road testing task. One of the good things I like about working with you all is the effort you make to do the job well. I agree with you, Mr. Ayala. The force this task requires are important to take into account. Definitely. I have already written some ideas for a monadic test, so we can discuss them, take a look. Good job. But have you figured out the cost? Some difficult decisions to make refer to fancy material and cost versus quality. Yes, boss. One of the most important factors in this job is managing costs, and I'm good at that. Okay, excellent. Good job. <laughs> you did a great job, okay? I like that. Okay, somebody else? And later on, we are going to practice in a breakout room. Hey, teacher. And Yesenia, you said, and? Maria Elena. And Maria Elena. Okay. Good morning. I try to announce we have green light to work on our latest protesting test. One of the good things I like about working with you is all effort you make to do the job well. I agree with you, Mr. Ayala. The efforts this tax requires are important to take into account. Definitely. I have already written some ideas for a um, monadic test. So we can discuss, discuss them, take a look. Good job. But how would you figure, figure out the cost? Some difficult decision to make refer to fancy materials and cost versus cost quality. Yes, one of the most important factors and this job is managed because, and I'm glad that. Okay, Maria Elena, could you read again this word that I'm showing you? Written. Repeat again, please. Written. 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 Okay, much better. Thank you. Thank you. 
Okay, if you don't have the material, you can make a screenshot because we need to go to the very cover room and practice. I don't know if you have any questions apart from here now before we can go and practice with somebody else. Just let me know if you have any questions apart from here, please. Uh, well, I was wondering what is monadic test. Ah, okay. I Google it, but I don't understand. <laughs> you didn't got any any idea? No. Okay. Um, later on, we are going to study a specific context about monadic test. Okay, don't worry about it. Más abajito en el contenido vamos a ver los conceptos de ellos. Así es que, okay. take it easy, take it easy. Okay. okay. But it's really nice that you Google it in order to get the meaning. But sometimes uh, the concepts that we got in Google are uh, kind of tricky and difficult to understand it. Okay. Okay, and somebody else wants to ask me something? No? No. Okay, here we go. Let us practice this conversation, please, and try to speak in a fluency way. Don't forget that you need to do it in a natural way. And at the moment that you are speaking English, you need to articulate your sounds in a different way that we do in Spanish in order that we can sound uh, close to the Americans, okay? Okay. Here we go, here we go. Uh, we have 10 view, okay, 10 groups, it's going to be 10. And do you consider that it's enough if I give you three minutes to do it or more than three minutes? Just tell me. Three minutes, teacher. Okay, okay, I like that. Here we go. Try to use your, your time in the right way, okay? Like your cell phone. Here we go.
Jonathan, it's ready. I, I see your hand. I see your hand apps. Teacher, una pregunta. ¿Por qué no podemos compartir cuando estamos en grupo? Ah, en, okay. en grupo. I don't know why. Let me check up what is happening here. Si no nos permite compartir y a veces algunos no tenemos eh, el material el, o, o estamos okay. en el celular. Ok, ok. I'm going to take into account your advice and remember me because sometimes I need to check up in order to be sure. Now you can do it. Ok, I do really sorry about that. Ok, who wants to start? Me teacher. Okay, sir, do it. Uh, Wendy. Okay. Espérame que me saca. Me saca si me. Si entro al, al manual. Oh, Tiene okay. para compartirlo. Okay, okay yes, of course. I, I can do it now. Hold on a second, please. I'm going to put it there. Okay, don't worry about it. Here we go, here we go. Okay, good morning. Okay. I am trying to announce we have green light to work on our last protesting tax. One of, of the good things I like about working with you all is the effort you make to do the job well. I agree with you, Ms. Ayala. The effort the stats require are important to take into account. Finally, I have already written some ideas for a monadic test, so we can discuss them, take a look. Good job, but have you figured out the cause some difficult decision to make refer to fancy material and cost versus quality. Yes, both one of the most important factors in this job is managing cost and I'm good at that. Okay, gracias. Okay, thank you. Somebody wants to do it? Escobar y Marlene. Escobar en Marlene. Ok. Go ahead, are, you ready? are you ready, Marlene? Are you ready? Ready. Yes, yes. Good morning. I am trying, trying to announce we have green light to work on our last product testing task. One of the good things I like about working with you all is the effort you make to do the job well. I agree with you, Mr. Ayala. The efforts that this stash require are important, important to take into account. Definitely. I have already written some ideas for a monadic test so we can discuss them. Take a look. Good job. But have you figured out the cause? Some difficult decisions to make refers to fantasy material. Material and cost versus quality. Yes, boss. One of the most important factor in this job is managing cost and I will add that.
This is the pronunciation of the word, this word, thrilled. 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 What's going on here? I need to move it a little bit in order. I want to put it next to the, the, the word, but I don't know why I can do it. Okay. Thrilled. Thrilled. Okay, thank you. Somebody else? Anna Lillian, you said. Anna Lillian and? Lisette. And Lisette, okay. Good morning. I am thrilled to announce we have bring light to work on our letter product testing such. One of the good things I like about working with you all is the effort you make to do the job well. I will with you, Mr. Ayala. The before these that require are important to take into account. Definitely. I have already re written some ideas for a monadic test. So we can discuss them. Take a look. Good job. But have to figure out the cost. Some difficult decision to make refer to fancy material and cost versus quality. Yes, boss. One of the most important factors in this job is managing cost and I am good at that. Okay, thank you. Next, Jenny. And, yes. And your topic, please. Um, good morning. I'm thrilled to announce we have green light to work on our latest product testing task. One of the good things I like about working with you is all is effort you make to do the job well. I agree with you, Mr. Ayala. The efforts this task require are important to take into account. Definitely. I have already written some ideas for a lunatic test, so we can discuss, discuss them. Take a look. Good job, but have you fi figured out the cause. Some difficult decision to make refer to fancy materials and cost qualities. Yes, boss. One of the most important factors in this job is managing the cost. I am good at that. Um, um, um. I don't know, you, you can see my mouse. Um. <laughs> you need to close your lips. Um, um. good at that. Okay. I'm good at that. Okay. Thank you. Somebody else. Diego and Mitisha. Diego and Ana Beatriz. Okay. Good morning. I am trying to announce we have green light to work on our latest product testing task. One of the good things I like about working with you, how is the effort you make to do the job well? I agree with you, Mr. Ayala. The effort the does require are important to make into account. Definitely. I have already written some ideas from a monadic test, so we can discuss them. Take a look. Good job. But help you figure it on the cause. Some difficult decision to make referring to fancy material in the cost versus quality. Yes, boss. One of the most important factors in this job is managing costs. I'm and I'm good at that. Thank you, okay. teacher. Okay, you're welcome, sir. Thank you. Ah, I, I've been trying to look this word. Retain, retain. 
written. Yes, written. Remember I told you yesterday, uh, in present is I, I write. In simple past, I wrote a letter. I have written a lot of poems. Written. Try to keep in mind, written. Okay. Okay. Let me see what else I hear. Well, I guess it was really nice. Okay, somebody else wants to do it? Mr. Chair. Okay, Rodrigo, welcome. Rodrigo, uh, Maria Concepcion. Okay, welcome. Okay. Good morning. I try to announce we have green light to work on our latest product testing task. One of the good things I like about working with you all is the effort you make to do the job well. I agree with you, Mr. Ayala. The effort is stuck for crime and important to take into account. Definitely, I have already written some ideas for a monadic death, so we can discuss them, discuss them, take a look. Good job. But have you figured out the cause? Some difficult decisions to make reference to fans, material and cost versus quality. Yes, but one of the most important important factor in this job is managing costs, and I'm good at that. Okay, the fancy material and cost versus quality versus quality. The fancy material and cost fancy, versus quality. Fancy material and cost versus quality. Of quality. Fancy, fancy material and cost. Fancy material. Quality. Listen, material. 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 Like with E. Material. Material. Put an E. Put an E. Okay. Put an e. Material. 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 Como que si fuese okay. una, una E, pero no bien, eh, no bien pronunciado. Material. Okay. Material. Okay. Thank you, sir. Oops. I need to stop because I need to check up the the attendance now. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay, Ana Beatriz. Present. Ana Lilian. Present. Ah, ahí está Ana Lilian, okay. Eh, Carlos Bautista. Present, teacher. Escobar. Present. Claudia Raquel. Present. Eh, Galileo. Present, sir. Okay. Eh, let me see, Rodrigo. Present, teacher. Welcome. Thank Juan you. Carlos. Present, teacher. Present. Okay. Francis Elizabeth. Hello, Francis. Francis. Okay, let me see, Laura. Present teacher. Lorena. Loren. No, Maria Concepcion. Present. Maria Elena. I'm here teacher. Mayra. 
Mayra. Miguel Ángel. Zaira. Estoy cayendo. Present teacher. Zaira. O no, me, no me había llamado todavía. Uh -huh. Zaira. Bueno, está saliendo algo ahí. Por... Santos Misael. Present teacher. Wendy Maribel. Present teacher. Ok. Eh, Jenny. Present teacher. Yesenia. Lisset. Present teacher. Diego. Present teacher. Brian. Ok. Mister, a mí no me mencionó. Ah, I miss someone, I guess. Ok. Let me see. Let me see here. What's your name? Jose Jonathan Vigil. Jose? Jonathan Vigil. Ah, Jose Jonathan Vigil, okay. Thank yeah, you. Yeah, because I was I was uh, calling to Francis. Okay. And I and I thought that I call you. Okay. Thank you. Mayra and Miguel is missing, and Lorena, and who else? Only then, okay, only three. Maybe one day I'm going to have it all. I would like to have all my students there present. Remember, uh, your assistant is really important in this process. Don't forget that. No se les olvide que su asistencia es contabilizada. Es muy contabilizada. Y se cuenta por minutos. Así es que. Si sabiendo. Por ahora de. Bueno, cada quien. Ok. Ok, we were talking about a conversation related with. Uh, how to evaluate a new product. We are going to continue talking about that, but in this case, we are going to resolve some question that we have. Okay, we have a uh, three question. Discuss the answer uh, to the following questions. Number one say what product testing strategy is mentioned in the conversation. Number two, what specific concern does Mr. Bellis have about the product? And number three say what is Mr. Avila in share of? Okay. Try to get the answer in the material and share it with me. Let me know what we are talking about it. What is the answer of those three questions? Tell me. Teacher. Hello, sir. Can you share the, the picture of three questions again, please? Okay, okay. No problem. Here we go. Here we go again. You have it there, sir. I got it. Thank you. If you have the material, you can make a screenshot. Una captura así rapidita. Yeah, I got and, it. Okay, okay. Don't worry about it. Okay, I'm waiting for the answer. If you have it, just write your hand and tell me. And tell me, okay, I consider, I believe, I guess, I, yeah, you can say it in that way. Sure. Hello. Someone last night um I don't know I heard you about um test 
and I think uh, this is uh, number one. Ah, it is the answer of number one. Yes. Okay. Okay. Yeah, it is mentioned there. Okay. Uh, what about the rest? Do you think that is right? Or not? Tell me. Manatics, manatics. Yeah, it, it is a manatic test. The one that is mentioned there. What about the second question? What is specific to sir? Tell me, sir. I think the second is about the cost of the product, the high cost of the, of the product. Or maybe the high cost of the material that is different. Really? Yeah, because remember that in order to create a product, we need to have a raw material. Before we need to have raw material and then we create the product, okay? Okay. And what about the third one? What is Mr. Avila in share of? He mentioned it there. Maybe. Yes, material, the more specific cost versus uh, cost. cost versus quality. You need to read it. You need to read it. Remember, what is Mr. Avila in share of? Try to remember the conversation. He said, I'm good at that. What are he talking about? Managing me, managing cost. Managing, managing. Managing, managing cost. Managing cost, okay, that's right. Excellent. Perfect, okay. Okay, let me see the time. Okay, here we go. We already answered this question. And today we are going to talk about something uh, on page number 18 in your material. I'm going to show you later on in order that you can see it. Let me see if I can show you. I got it here, but I need to know if I can do it in, in the book directly. Jesus, I don't know what happened with your cameras. I don't see anybody, only just the names. Hello, are you there? My goodness, what's going on here? I don't see the faces. Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Yes. Okay. Yes. Because I can see your faces. I think that I'm alone here. I don't know what is happening there because you don't want to see, you don't want to show your face. I don't know what's going on. Okay. Let me see what we're going to see next. Mm, I guess it's not going to be this one. Hold on a second. I'm going to show you in the book. I guess it's going to be better. Because, um, well, before I show you what I want, I need that you take a look at the conversation again. And 
pay attention about the word that is involved. So please try to pay attention to these phrases, one of the sins, one of the good sins. And now we have the verb is right here. The efforts are uh, some difficult decisions refer one of the most important factors is I need that you think about those expressions, please. And tell me something. What is happening there? Hello, 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 hello. Are you there? What can you tell me? Why do we have in bold those words? ¿Por qué tenemos en negrilla esas palabritas? What do you think? Tell me, what do you think? No idea? How we call it? Maybe it's a common phrase in the United States? Mm. Well, so close, so close. But, uh, well, I'm going to show you and later we are going I'm to. I'm not sure, but in, for example, brown or blue thing is the equal are found difficult decision present. No, 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 Aha, okay. There is an special term in order to talk about this. I'm going to show you right yes. here. Oh, well, I, I told you to show you in, in the material first. Later on, I'm going to give you extra examples about this. I got it here. Let me show you. Can you see it? Yes. Yes? Yes. Ah, okay. How to achieve bare agreement. We call it bare agreement with complex subject. Take a look at these two last words, complex subjects. Okay, look at the example in the box, then complete the exercises below. Okay, I need that you pay attention about this because based on that, we are going to talk about it, okay? Subject that are preceded by expression of quantity at curl complete subject. I need that you understand this concept. Subject that are preceded by expression of quantity are called complex subject. Is that clear? It is clear the concept because I need to be sure that you understand what is what is the meaning. Yes. Somebody yes. tell somebody tell me in Spanish in order to be sure that the rest understand. Yo. Dice que el sujeto está presidiendo una expresión de cantidad. Sí. Y no sé, sujeto, no sé, ahí sí no sé qué quiere decir. <laughs> uh -huh. okay. okay, somebody else wants to try? Un sujeto repuesto. Ah, okay, but, but I need the, the, the whole concept. Un sujeto concede una expresión de cantidad de llamado sujeto complementario. Close, close. Take a look at the first word in the sentence, please. 
sujetos. Acordémonos que en español, a la hora de ya de hacer eh, eh, la traducción, ahí vamos a decir los sujetos. En inglés no, no, lo, lo, no los ubicamos. En español tendría que decir los sujetos que son precedidos por expresiones de cantidad son llamados ajá, ¿What else? Complejos. 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 Sujetos complejos, teacher. Ok. They take either. Listen. They take either a singular or a plural verb form depending on the number. Dependiendo de qué dice? The number. Singular el número de, de sujetos no. que están en la primera oración. Ok, hold on, hold on, hold on. Take it easy, take it easy. They take either a singular. Entendamos esa parte, por favor. They take either a singular or a plural pair. Ellos, ¿sí? ¿Qué pasa después de ellos? Ellos van a tomar el, el singular o el plural, la forma singular o plural, dependiendo del, del número. Ellos toman ya sea, oiga bien, ya sea una forma singular o plural del verbo, dependiendo del número. Singular o plural of the quantifier. Ya sea el singular o el plural del cuantificador. Ok, let us see, let us see that concept in order to have a clear idea. Ok, we have some examples here. The first of the decision has been made to go ahead with the plan. Ok, take a look at this example. The first of the decision has been made to go ahead with the plans. Is that clear for you? Or not? Hello? Yes, teacher. Okay, okay. I ask you this question because suddenly somebody could say, okay, if I have decision here and it is plural, I don't need to have a singular here. But this one is related with the, the word that differs. The first of decision has been made to go ahead with the plan. Okay. Listen to the explanation. Here, defer refer to one of the decision. So, The verb must be in the singular form has. Is that clear for you? Yes. Okay, yes. What, about the, what about the rest? Claudia, is it is clear? Yes, teacher. Yes. Okay. I can see all the, your name. Uh, let me see, Juan Carlos Rivas, what can you tell me? It is clear? Clear, teacher. Please it. Laura? No. <laughs> no? Yes, teacher. No. Okay, who, say, who, say, who said no? Be honest if you don't understand something and I can explain you. I can switch my explanation in another words. But I need that you have clear because this topic is kind of tricky and you need to have a good information about it in order that you can do it in the right way, okay? 
Okay, right here, take a look at the, at the sentence that we have. The first of the decision, we are talking about the first is one. For that reason, we have has right here. It is the explanation say here, defer refer to one of the decision, only to one. So the verb must, in, uh, must be in the singular form. But that is the reason why we have has. Yeah. Clear or not clear? Tell me. I got it, teacher. I think okay, if okay. the subject if the oh. soldier reflects in a quantity. Oh, so okay. if uh -huh. this quantity is this quantity is singular, the principal verb is singular too, is or are. In this case is has or is. Okay, let us see the next example, let it be. One of the good things I like about working with you all is the effort you make to do the job right. Yes. Okay. You need to have a clear why we have is right here because we are talking about one. You single, yeah. okay? Here one is a single of various good scenes. So the verb must also be singular too. In this case, it's gonna be is, okay? And right here we have a, a different example, talking about um, something different. Some difficult decisions to make in relation to fancy materials, are about the cost and the quality. Tell me, why do I have R right here? Because, because say some because say some difficult. Ah, he's talking it's about plural. Ah, okay, okay, good point. In, in this part, uh, um, one difficult and uh, the bad is is. But oh, okay. okay, here some refer to more than one difficult decision. That means that it's plural. So the verb must be plural. Okay. Take a look at the next example. A majority and a number take a plural verb when they are used with a plural noun. Example given, a majority of product developers prefer to use blind tests. What does mean? When you use the word majority and a number, in this case, take the plural verb, when they are using with the plural noun, but in this case, we are talking a majority of product developers prefer to use blind tests. I don't know if you have any questions so far from here. I don't want to confuse you. I know I, I got a lot of material about this topic and I'm going to show you some more example. But uh, if you got the meaning of what I'm trying to explain you and you are able to solve the exercises that we have here, we are going to do it when we make the review. For example, right here with the same and below, should the verb from that agreed with the subjects. Compare your answer with the pattern. For example, we have some of the participants in the testing group have or has not arrived yes, yet. You are going to choose have, have or has. And you are oh. going and you are going to tell me why you are choosing that one. 
Okay, I'm going to give you some minutes in order that you can resolve it. But um, let, let, let me show you something now. No, I guess if you have uh, any questions so far, maybe I can show you. De ese tema tengo mucho información porque en cierta manera es como medio complicado, ¿no? Okay, let me show you this. I don't know if you can see it. Yes. Yes, teacher. Okay, yes. but take a look yeah. at the, the, the example that I have here in letter A. Son of the book is good. And also, I have the letter B. This is a plural verb. Son of the books are good. And maybe somebody could ask, why do you have is here? And why do you have are here? What can you tell me about it? In most situations, okay, tell me. I'm sorry. Go ahead. I think uh, the letter A is talking about one specifically book. In the letter B, uh, they talking about um, more one books. Hmm. Um, how can I tell you? Do, you? do you know what is the meaning of the same of? Same of? What is the meaning of same of in Spanish? Alguno de. Uno de. We got two, two different meanings. Tenemos dos diferentes significados. Y ahí es donde tenemos que tener cuidado. Sí. And also we can say un poco de. Sí. Ok. O incluso podríamos decir una parte del libro es buena. Sí. But right here, some of the books are good. Okay. Algunos de los libros son buenos. It's different, you know. For the reason said in most equation of quantity, the verb is determined by the nouns or pronoun that follow off. For example, uh, in A, son of, last singular noun, singular verb. That means if we have singular here, we are going to have singular here. And in letter B, if we have a uh, plural, we are going to have plural right here, okay? Okay, later on, I'm going to show. Let us go to the exercise. I would like to see. I know that you are going to be able to resolve, okay? Let me show you the exercises. And I'm going to give you some time in order that you can resolve. If you don't have it in your material, you can make a screenshot and I'm going to give you some time in order that you can resolve. And then we are going to discuss your answer, okay? I'm going to stop sharing. Work on it, work on it, please.
Okay, let me see what's going on there. Okay. Are you close to finish? Finish. Okay, Maria.
Okay. Okay, let us compare your answer in order to be sure that you did a good job, okay? I don't know if you are ready. Ready, teacher. Okay. Okay, who wants to read the number one? Uh, I need to have at least six different participants, okay? I'll teach her in the first. Okay, read the first one, please, and explain it. The reason why you are going to choose the, the B form, the, the, the bare form that you are going to choose, okay? Tell me. Because in the line, uh, mentioned participants on um, plural. Okay. Some of the participants in the testing group have not arrived yet. Okay, have not, ha, I not arrived, have not arrived have yet. Not arrived yet. Okay. Okay, that's clear. Excellent. Second, please. Escobar, teacher. Second. Escobar, 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 and then the lady. One of the factors to decide on the best type of test are the characteristic of the product in itself. Uh -huh. Somebody teacher. have in a different way? I think is in, in yes. the second. Okay, read it, read it. Yes. One of the factors to decide on the best type of test is the characteristics of the product itself. Uh -huh. Why do you think it is this? Because it is one of the factors. Yeah. No, at the beginning, plural. at the beginning, we had the word one of the factor. Okay, that is true. Take into account Escobar and write it down. And I need that you pronounce in the right way the word characteristic. Repeat, characteristic. Characteristic. Listen, listen, characteristic. 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 Not like a, uh, we are going to apply the A sound, characteristic. Characteristic. Okay, okay. Correct. Okay, number three, please. Me, teacher. Okay. Jenny. Jenny. And a number of customers are satisfied with the cost performance of the new mob. Okay. Because our customers. What? Uh, customer is in plural for the reason you are using plural. Yes. Bingo. It is right. Okay. Number four. Who wants to do it? Me, teacher. Okay. Do it, sir. 
The first of the suggestions I want to implement is the design of the level. Ah, okay. Tell me, explain me why you use is. Uh, because at the beginning of the sentence, it says the first. Ah, okay, excellent. So that express uh, basically the meaning of maybe one idea only. It is expressing so, number, okay? <laughs> Singular, so that's okay. why you said the first of the suggestions. Okay, excellent. I like that. I like that. Number five, somebody else, please. Number five, uh, teacher. okay, tell me. <laughs> A majority of tester has pointed out the need to make our products lighter. Okay, could you read it again? A majority, majority of tester has pointed out the need to make our product lighter. And could you tell me why you choose has? instead of hair? Because it's a majority. Ah. Okay. This thing let, is us, let, us, let, let us listen to somebody else and, and we are going to compare. Okay, somebody wants to talk? Me, teacher. Okay, tell me, I sir. think it's hard because tester is in plural. Oh, okay, bingo, that's right. A majority of tester. Yeah. Okay, that is right. And number six. Number six. Uh, me to share. Okay, tell A me. number of comments to get. That's the Francis on the candle in the best characteristic. 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 Ah, teacher. Characteristic. 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 A number of men. Okay. And then what do you have? Tell me again. Subjects. Suggest. Yes. The different of the candle is the best characteristic. Okay. Explain me why do you have suggest? Hello. I can because hear you, teacher. Because comment is in plural, teacher. Okay, comment is in plural. That is the key word. Okay. Okie dokie. I feel happy because you understand the topic. Okay, now let us count it. How many right ones do you get out of six? Can you share it with me, Claudia? Me six of six. Okay, Diego, good. The six. Six out of six? Yes. Okay, yes. excellent. Maria Concepcion. Maria, Maria Concepcion. Hi, teacher. Tell me. Six. Six out of six? No, five. Ah, five, okay, okay, five. Yes. Anna Lillian, thank you. Hi. Lisette, do you want to say something? I'm five because I don't understand why the number five. Ah, you have some doubts in number five? I don't understand. Ah, okay, okay. What is, is plural or, or not? Okay, okay, okay. Let me show you something. 
I'm going to clarify that. Number five, you are talking about that, okay? Let me show you, let me show you. Say a majority of testers. Okay, we are talking about testers in plural. Yes. But let me show you the, the book. Yes, but I yes, yeah. but I okay, I hold. say has. Okay, hold on a second. Let me let me show you the books. In the book, I'm going to explain you this. You say has, okay? Okay, can you see it? Yes, teacher. Yes. Yes. Okay, I'm going to scroll line here. Okay, number five. A majority of testers, right here, you need to take a look at this. This word is in plural for the reason we, we need to have this word, okay? At least that we have a tester has, okay? Is that clear? Hola? It's clear. ¿Le queda claro, compañera? Sí. Yo tengo una duda, Tichi. Ah, ok. Who is it? Who is it? Sí, sí, tiene. Has. Lo convierte en plural. Perdóneme, no le estoy comprendiendo. O sea, es que tengo duda ahí si es plural por, por la palabra has. How has. ¿Cuál vale. de los dos convierte en plural? En plural. Ok, ok. La palabra tester está en singular o en plural? Plural, teacher. Porque un tester es una persona que prueba un producto o servicio y varios testers son varias personas que hacen el mismo oh, proceso. Ok, entonces nosotros ya sabemos que el has lo vamos a usar solamente cuando vamos a hablar de terceras personas, ya sea él o ella. ¿Sí? ¿Comprendido? Sí, sí. Yeah. ¿En qué es, teacher? Ah, ok. Sí, no hay problema cuando haya necesidad de explicárselo así en español porque me interesa que le quede muy claro y que no se vaya con esa duda. Y me gusta que pregunten porque eso eh, muestra el interés, the level of interest that you have in order to learn something about the class. Okay, another question, no? No? Ooh, let me see the time that I have. Ooh, is it is too short. I need to go ahead and and resolve the next exercise in order that we can talk about different aspects. Okay, let me see right here. This is building the vocabulary, determine the in chart below, describe type of test and research method connected to product testing. Uh, what you're going to do is just that you're going to match the term to their definition and we are going to check the answer later on. And right here, we have seven different names, like the first one that is size and handling test. We need to look for the concept. Use test, branded test, blind test, monadic method. What is the monadic method? We need to know. Sequential monadic method, is a different one, and pair comparison test. Maybe we are going to resolve. Um, we are not going to have enough time in order to resolve it today. And what I'm going to do in this minute is that I'm going to read it, the concept, and later on you are going to decide which one is number one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. 
For example, in the phones, a consumer use or cite and handle one product, then another and are asked to indicate which of the two they prefer. Remember, I'm just reading the concept. Consumer use the product in real circumstances. They use a product, cite it, handle it, and rate it later. Later on, you are going to decide which one is. Uh, the next one, consumer take the product to be used either as a sample or for an extended period, as they could usually use it in their own home. The next concept said, consumer are aware of the brand they are trying. This test better reflects the real world experience and the value of the brand. The next one say consumer use the product, cite it and handle it. They rate it, then they use, cite, handle another product and rate it. The consumer does not rate both products against each other. The next one said this test is a good option when there are significant tactile or visual element of the product for a consumer to experience. And the last concept said products are tested and branded so the consumer focus is strictly on the product's characteristic and not on the brand name. I know the time is not enough in order that we can solve it, but we, we are going to check it later on. You are going to have the opportunity to uh, research, to investigate something about it and relate it with, with the concept that we have at the left size. And that way, we are, you are going to build your own vocabulary related with this kind of uh, term. Okay. And maybe in the review, we are going to work in the part seven. That is going to be, let me see. Uh, we need to count five sections. It's going to be maybe on Friday that we are going to. No, no, no. It's going to be on Monday, I guess. Okay, later on we are going, you are going to discuss testing strategies to fit the characteristic of the product and brainstorm the advantages of testing the product using the strategies the group have selected and then decide uh, the best strategy to test the new product and share it with somebody else. But first of all, we need to resolve uh, exercise number six in order to be sure what we are talking about it, okay? Um, what I, I'm going to help you only just with one, with the one that somebody asked me. Do you remember the one that somebody asked me? Monadic tests. Ah, what is the monadic method? What do you think? What do you think is a monadic method? Any idea? It sounds like it's focused on only one because of the term. <laughs> Maybe. Mm, could be. But let me tell you that it's not that one. It is the second one. Consumer use the product in real circumstances. They use a product, cite, 
cite it, handle it, and rate it later. That is Menadics method. Okay, le dejo ahí ese quiebra coco para que piensen y lo resuelvan de la mejor manera. Later on, we are going to compare the answer. Don't worry about it. And just try to make your best effort in order to solve it. And later on, we are going to compare it, okay? I don't know if you have any questions so far from here. Right now, we are so close to finish. I would like to hear you say something. No? No, teacher, I don't have questions. You don't have any questions so far from here. Okay, somebody else? No? Okay, I'm going to check up the attendance. And let me see who is the person that is going to stay with me today. Ojo, aprovechen por favor los 10 minutos. Hay algunas personas que eh, no toman los 10 minutos. I don't know why. Okay. Today is section six, right? Francis Elizabeth, are you there? No? Yes, teacher. I ah, ah, Francis. And, and now you are pretty busy again, no? No, teacher. Ah, okay, Francis. Okay, um, let me check out the attendance first and then you can prepare your question that you are going to ask, me, okay? Ana Beatriz Campos de Guzman? Present teacher. Ana Lilian Reyes? No, se fue. Carlos Alberto? Bautista? Present, Escobar? Present. Present. Hernández, Claudia. Present. Elizabeth. Martínez, Elizabeth. Se nos dormía otra vez. Present, present, teacher. Galileo. Present, sir. Vigil, Jonathan. Present. Hernández, Rodrigo. Present, teacher. Rivas, Carlos. Present. Vigil Carolina. Present teacher. Okay. Lorena Beatriz. Maria Concepcion. Present. Okay. Maria Elena. I'm here teacher. Mayra Veralice. Miguel Angel. Zaira. Marlene. Present teacher. Okay. Santos Misael. Present teacher. Wendy Maribel. Present teacher. Jenny. Present teacher. Eh, Yesenia Lisset. Present teacher. Diego. I'm here. Brian. Present teacher. Okay, los mencioné a todos, ¿sí? Yes. yes. Ah, ok. Entonces no me estoy durmiendo. No, 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 no. Ok, thank you very much. I hope to see you tomorrow. Have a wonderful night. Take a rest. In order that you get ready tomorrow morning. In order to start early to work. Okay, thank you. Good night. Good night. Good night. Bye bye. 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 See you. See you. Bye. See you. Bye. 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 Good night, teacher. Good night. Night dreams. Sweet dreams. Lisette, how are you, Lisette?
Okay. As you can see, the personal sign for today was difficult. Maybe I had some problem, I don't know. Yesenia. Hello, Yesenia. Sorry, teacher. Tell me. <laughs> I don't know if you have any question. I, no. was, I was wondering, maybe you have a question or something like that. No. Okay. <laughs> okay, thank you. Then I hope to see you tomorrow. Try to resolve the problem in the platform, please. Because uh, um, in this week, uh, I, I guess that you are going to have the midterm. Trate de resolver todos los ejercicios. Que más creo que ya esta semana toca el midterm. Okay, teacher. Okay. Good night. Okay, thank you. Good night. Bye-bye.